Hey, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to Derek Austin's Level Up Travel. You know I love to talk about points, miles, rewards, rewards, credit cards, credit cards in general. Love to talk about cash back, love to talk about the programs, like hotel programs, airline programs, love to talk about credit card programs, like American Express membership rewards, like city thank you points, like Capital One Miles, and of course Chase Ultimate Rewards. And I love to talk about travel. Today I want to talk about Wyndham Rewards, okay? Um, and here's the thing, it's a lot better than you think. This is really Capital One's and, and City's answer to the Hyatt program. I know, you know what you're saying, like no way. Uh, you know, Hilton, I mean Hyatt points are worth like anywhere from like 1.6 to 2 point. I know they took a dip, maybe they're at like 1.6, 1.7 now. They used to be closer to two cents per point. But hey, yeah, so Wyndham Rewards is that good. And the thing is, the reason why it is, because it's partnership with a company called Vacasa, okay? Vacasa, and I'll put the description, the in the description below, I'll put the, web, the uh, website for Vacasa. It's a vacation rental program, okay? It's kind of like Airbnb. Here's the cool thing about Vacasa compared to Airbnb is that it's actually managed by a management, professional management company. It's not just like uh, Joe Blow from the corner drugstore has its, his, um, his uh, you know, rental property there and sometimes he cleans it, sometimes he doesn't. And uh, yeah, I, I've been to many Airbnbs and they're hit or miss. Sometimes they're run really great by, you know, the private owner and sometimes they're, they really don't, you know, you can see the pictures and it's not anything like that or it's dirty, it's grimy, um, certain bugs are there. Um, yeah, so you, it could be really hit or miss with that. Since it's professionally done, you're gonna have a lot better experience with Vacasa. And here's a great part again about, well, here's a negative part about Vacasa. It's only in North America and like Costa Rica and Belize. Also in Hawaii, so that's North America I know, but it's kind of like out in the Pacific Ocean. So Hawaii is part of that. And one of my examples is gonna be Hawaii um, in a vacation rental property. It's and again, professionally run, so it's really great. So here's the cool, the cool thing about it. So it's 15,000. Uh, Wyndham Rewards points for any any property with Vacasa that is one bedroom or less, so it's a one bedroom or studio, right? Um, then you'll get it for 15,000 points. Covers all the, you know, any kind of fees or taxes, which is great. Um, so how do you book it, right? You book it by going on Vacasa's website, finding the availability, as long as it doesn't really matter the money, um, there is some blackouts, but there's not that many blackouts. As long as it doesn't really matter about the money, it's a matter of it's one bedroom or studio, up to one bedroom, then you can have it for 15,000. If it's more than one bedroom, like two bedrooms, two baths, three bedrooms, two baths, it's just gonna be more points. But 15,000 seems to really, really be an amazing uh, little spot. It's kind of like you get your own little hotel room, but you know it's a vacation rental spot. So it, 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 some people like that better. I kind of do. Um, I always liked the Airbnbs, I just didn't like the consistency of the product, right? This is now gives you consistency of the product. So, how do you earn Wyndham Rewards points? So, you have, of course, Capital One I talked about, and, and City Thank You points. So, you know, just an example, if you transfer points from um, Capital One, you have the Venture X card, you're getting 2X on every single purchase, you're getting two Wyndham points per, per uh, dollar spent. Pretty great. You easily can get two cents out of this program. Easily, okay? If you, especially if you're going to like vacation areas. If you're just doing it in like the middle of nowhere, yeah, you're not gonna get it. But if you go to Hawaii, you go into like California, like Big Sur or something like that, or like I said, Maui and Hawaii. And I'm gonna give you an example of Maui, Hawaii. But here's the other way to earn. Wyndham has their own cards with Barclays. They're really, actually really, really good cards. Um, they had the uh, Wyndham Rewards Earner, zero annual fee, gets five times the points on uh, gas station and Wyndham properties, 2X on groceries and dining, and then $1 everywhere else. Uh, really good, then there's a Wind Wyndham Rewards Earner Plus card, $75 annual fee, you get six times the points on Wyndham properties, gas stations, four times the points on grocery stores, 
and dining and one dollar uh, one point everywhere else you also get 7500 bonus points every account anniversary so that is really good so that covers the annual fee and then some because these points instead of one cent a point which would be 75 dollars it's you could, if you're using a vacasa problem you get at least two cents a point okay that's why i compare it to the higher program um Wyndham Rewards Earner Plus, $95 annual fee. Um, and that's a business, bu oh, sorry, Earner Business Card. It's Wyndham Rewards Earner Business Card, $95 annual fee. And what do you get? You get eight times the points at Wyndham Properties and gas stations, that's a lot. Five times the points on marketing, advertising, utilities. It's a business card, so it's more business oriented there. One, one, uh, set, one point per dollar spent everywhere else. Um, and then 15,000 bonus points for every account anniversary. That's really huge, actually. Uh, co more than covers the annual fee, uh, but it is a business card and everyone's comfortable with that. Um, of course, you, uh, also you have what we're talking about, city thank you points. You know, you get three times the points on gas stations, eating out at restaurants, um, at, with, the, with the Premier card from city. So you're getting three times the points on all those products, you know, if you don't want to go and get a Wyndham card specifically, don't want to commit to Wyndham, you know? So there's other good parts about Wyndham, like their status on those cards and stuff like that too. So th those are some great ways to earn Wyndham cards. Uh, the, the cards from Barclays, the, you have the Capital One program, and you have the City uh, Thank You program. Again, you're gonna easily be able to get two cents a point at places you want to go. Here's just an example of uh, and by the way, I'm, I'm looking at an article, oh, look, before we get to that, we're looking at an article here, and I'm gonna link this down below as well. Um, a lot of the information I got was from here. I've also done a little research myself, which I'm gonna get into in just a second. But uh, February 25th, 2021, you see the, uh, you can now redeem Wyndham Rewards points at 15,000 plus Vacasa rent rental, vacation rentals. That's the title of the, of the article this is from the points guy okay so yeah it's uh again now see how you book it by the way you go again on vacasa's rentals uh website find the availability right one bedroom or zero will be fifteen thousand points then you call wyndham rewards and book the property that's how you do it I haven't done it yet so i don't know the specifics of it i might do it soon because i was thinking about actually hawaii it really looks like a great deer so Great deal. So here's a property that I found in Maui, okay? I'm not gonna really go into it because who knows it's gonna be available for you, but it's in Maui in La Hayana, Hawaii, and that is again in Maui. It's for 12 nights, so it's 180,000 um, Wyndham Rewards points, or 100, uh, 180,000 thank you points, or 180,000 Capital One miles, and because it's an easy transfer from those programs. And this is this property will be 180,000 points or $6,058. That's 3.3 cents a point. This is very common in places like this, okay? So, guys, I really think this is the answer to, to, to the Hyatt uh, problem that these other programs have, right? The Hyatt is such a good program. This is a great program. You got to at least have this on your radar. Hotel points. And, and this type of thing with a vacas or va uh, vacation rental, it's just easier to use than um, a lot of times getting uh, those uh, those great rewards flights, business class flights, and things like that. You know, so and it's also just good. You know, a lot of times get get something out of uh, you know where you're actually staying. That could be really expensive. Like I was saying, six thousand dollars for twelve nights in uh, Maui, or. 180,000 points. So if I just cash that uh, that out on like purchase eraser, $1,800, or I can get $6,000 for it uh, in, uh, in vac a Vicasa vacation rental. So again, down below, you're gonna have the article from the points guy. You're also gonna have Vicasa's um, website down below. Guys, get on this. It, it's a great program. Uh, Wyndham Rewards program using Vacasa. So download Vacasa, get onto Wyndham Rewards program, start, you know, you can, if you have like a lot of points in uh, Capital One or City Thank You Points, or you just a, a great, win, you have a lot of Wyndham Rewards points, move them over, 
book these, book these. It's awesome. It's awesome. Okay. That's it really it for, for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Please give it a, a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. We're approaching 700 subscribers now. We're at like 670 the last time I looked. Thank you all for subscribing to the channel. Hit that bell notification so every time I come out with a video like this, you'll be the first to know. Hope you liked the video, guys. See you in the next one. Bye.